Hi viewers, welcome to my channel Passion for Craft by Renews Blossom. Today I'm going to show you all how to make this glamorous and glittering cell phone pouch in a very easy and simple method. This project I'm going to make it in two parts and in this part I'm going to show you how to make this golden cell phone pouch. If you like the projects in my channel, please subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed yet. And don't forget to click on the notification icon so that you'll be notified with my new videos. These are the things required to do this project. It's a very easy and simple project. You all will love doing it. To start this project, first you need this golden net lace. Now take your cell phone and keep it on the top of your net lace and mark your measurement. Cut your lace to that measurement. This is the tricky and the main part of the project you should know. First thread the needle with the golden thread and put a knot. Now bring down the needle to the point where you have put the knot. Now straighten your thread and put a knot below your needle. Make sure your knot is not so thick. If the knot becomes thick, it won't be easy to stitch through the tiny squares in the net lace. Straighten your thread before stitching. The first step for your stitching, insert your needle through the first tiny square in your net lace. After stitching through your first square, pull your thread slowly. Now this is the tricky part, you have to insert your needle inside the loop of the thread in the bottom. Pull your thread slowly to give you a neat finishing. Keep stitching through the tiny squares in the net lace. When you come to the corner of your pouch, put some knots. I put around 3 to 4 knots to hold it tightly. Now do the same stitching on the other side of your pouch. You have to follow the same procedure. You have to first thread the needle and put a knot. Then bring the needle to the point where you have put the knot. Put another knot below the needle.
Now stitch through the tiny squares in the net lace. For your first stitch, insert the needle inside the loop of the thread in the bottom. Start stitching through the tiny squares in your net lace. When you reach to the corner of your pouch, put around 3 to 4 knots. Insert a transparent sheet or a paper inside your pouch. The reason is that when you stick your leaves on top of your pouch, your pouch will not stick to the other side of it. Here I'm sticking golden leaves on both the sides of the pouch. I'm going to use this beautiful golden flower leaves to decorate the pouch. I'm sticking three flowers on the center of the pouch. You can stick the flowers to the pattern you like to design the pouch. I'm sticking few crystal white stones to design the pouch. Stick stone leaves on bottom of the both sides of the pouch. This is how your pouch will look after sticking flowers and stones on it. Now remove the transparent sheet from your pouch. This is the final step for finishing your pouch. Now stitch this rope lace on both the corners of your pouch. Put around 3 to 4 knots on your rope lace to make it tight. Now cut your rope lace to your desired length. Now take a small bit of velcro and stick it on the center of your pouch. Now your pouch is completed. This is how your glittering cell phone pouch will look after finishing. If you liked and found this project useful, give a like to my channel and subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed yet. Thank you for watching. Take care and bye bye.